Ilani Pala shop opened August 1st, 1984 in the Eva wing of Pali Kua, or Iolani Barracks. There were 13 volunteers, which unfortunately dropped to three by January of 85. I was one of the shop volunteers on Tuesdays. It was very, very limited. There were seven postcards. There were four sets of slides, which later expanded to five. And then books. And then we got new computer materials, because first it was just a box and a drawer. The board decided this was to be the palace shop, to differentiate who we were and what we carried from the gift shops that were in Waikiki, because we wanted to make it very clear this was an educational shop, an educational bookstore. In the past few years, the palace has really evolved into the place to find really cool Hawaii items. My dear Auntie Carol worked at the palace shop, and it was kind of a place where you went, you know, for, you know, people all around the area, from the legislature next door, to the folks at the different businesses, and I think that's what we've become again. Ekolu is a wonderful director of retail who has a sharp eye on things and a lot of great ideas, and so I think he's really made it a go-to place for a lot of people who may not even be coming on a tour of the palace, they just want to go into the shop. We carry a lot of items that are made by local businesses here in Hawaii. Kanaka made items like lauhala, koa pieces and jewelry. I think being able to share our mo'olelo and our history with visitors, with Kama'aina and with Kanaka Oivi is the most fulfilling part of my job. The Palace Shop is so important to the Friends of Iolani Palace. It's an important revenue stream. Not only the shop in general, but the online shop as well. It's an important part of the funding that we need to continue with our mission of restoring this beautiful, beautiful palace and sharing her story with the world. You know, I've covered Iolani Palace as a reporter for decades and loved it. And then my aunt was here. And so when I made the decision to come here, I wasn't even thinking of that at that moment. And then she brought it up and she was so excited. And um, until she passed a few years ago, we were able to, to share memories of what it was like being here at Iolani Palace. And it just feels, you know, kind of like I was sharing part of her legacy in being here. All the revenue generated in the shop go towards the preservation of the palace and that allows us to continue sharing and perpetuating the history and the story of RLEE with the rest of the world. So your purchases help to keep the lights on and keep what we're doing as the Friends of Iolani Palace going for generations to come.